At the Army 2024 exhibition, the Russian Army showcased its latest innovation in unmanned ground vehicle UGV, technology, the Impulse KPTM. Designed to enhance mine-laying capabilities, the Impulse KPTM represents a significant advancement in battlefield engineering with its specialized features and versatile operational roles. The Impulse KPTM is equipped with a sophisticated mine-laying system featuring 30 launch barrels. These barrels can accommodate a range of mine dispensers, including the KPOM-3, KPTM-3, and KPTM-4, allowing the vehicle to deploy up to 120 anti-tank and anti-personnel mines simultaneously. This capacity enables the creation of diverse and strategically effective minefields, tailored to various operational needs. In addition to its mine-laying functionality, the Impulse KPTM is designed to tow different types of vehicles and trailers, adding flexibility to its operational roles. This capability allows it to support a range of logistical and field tasks beyond its primary mine-laying function. The Impulse KPTM has a maximum speed of 10 km per hour and is capable of climbing slopes with a gradient of up to 25 degrees. It can handle a roll angle of up to 15 degrees, enabling it to traverse a variety of terrains. With a total weight of 1,350 kg and powered by engines with a combined output of 20 kW, the vehicle can operate continuously for up to 4 hours, making it a robust option for extended field operations. For operational control, the Impulse KPTM uses a radio control channel that supports video information transmission and control signals over a line-of-sight distance of up to 1,000 meters in open terrain. For missions requiring greater range, the vehicle can switch to an optical cable control channel, extending communication capabilities to distances of up to 20,000 meters. The Impulse KPTM is designed to deploy several types of mines, each with specific characteristics. KPOM-3 Dispenser This dispenser releases POM-3 anti-personnel mines, each equipped with seismic sensors to detect vibrations such as footsteps. Measuring 200 mm in height and 60 to 70 mm in diameter, the POM-3 mines weigh 1.3 kg and disperse approximately 1,850 fragments over an effective range of 8 to 13 meters. They have a shelf life of 11 years and feature selective targeting mechanisms to minimize collateral damage. KPTM-3 Dispenser The KPTM-3 deploys PTM-3 anti-tank mines, which utilize a shaped charge to penetrate vehicle armor and are equipped with a magnetic influence fuse activated by changes in the magnetic field. Each PTM-3 mine weighs 8.5 kg and contains 1.8 kg of TG-40 explosive. These mines are designed to self-destruct 16 to 24 hours after deployment to reduce risks associated with unexploded ordnance. KPTM-4 Dispenser This dispenser holds two PTM-4 anti-tank mines, each weighing 3.25 kg and containing 1.4 kg of TG-40 explosive. The PTM-4 mines are triggered by a non-contact magnetic igniter, the VT-14, which detects magnetic fields generated by nearby vehicles. These mines can be set to self-destruct after 8, 12, 24, or 48 hours and are programmed to deactivate automatically after 120 days to further mitigate unexploded ordnance risks. The introduction of the Impulse KPTM underscores the Russian Army's commitment to advancing mine-laying technologies and enhancing battlefield capabilities. By combining robust engineering with advanced mine deployment systems, the Impulse KPTM offers a powerful tool for creating effective minefields and supporting a range of operational scenarios. Its ability to deploy various types of mines, coupled with its operational flexibility and advanced communication systems, positions it as a significant asset in modern military engineering. As the Impulse KPTM begins to enter service, its role in enhancing mine-laying operations will likely have a considerable impact on military tactics and logistics, reinforcing the strategic value of unmanned ground vehicles in contemporary warfare.